So we have Super Saiyan 3 Goku and Super Saiyan 2 Vegeta. You know what's funny about this character is this is actually the exact opposite of what happened last year. Uh, if you guys remember to the big release we had prior to the fourth anniversary, we had the tag 17 and 18 release and they honestly overshadowed most of the anniversary. It was like they dropped and then we got UI Goku and then we got Dragon Fist. And I wouldn't even particularly say it was relatively close between the power level of those characters. The androids just stomped. Um, I would say it's definitely debatable between if the androids are straight up better than Ultra, Ultra Super Vegeta or not. But this year, this character drops and then we get Goku and Frieza. We get Orange Piccolo. I mean, he's not the greatest character ever, but we get the Gammas and then we get Ultra Vegeta Blue. And it's like, where is this unit? <laughs> what? What? were they thinking with this character this is probably one of the most saddest like this is well yeah I, I mean i guess i would say this is probably one of the saddest releases ever um this character released and then like two weeks later we got ultra kid boo and you look at those two releases that are separated by just a few weeks and how are is the power level of those two releases so different it, it makes almost no sense. I, I mean, I, I think what probably happened is they, they created this character. This is the first character ever with the preparation mode mechanic with the transcendent Kamehameha. Later, we got the Gammas. The, they're, they're, right now, th those are the only two characters that exist with that mechanic. I think the Gammas were definitely done justice with that mechanic, but they were probably just scared, to be honest, of that mechanic with this character releasing. So I guess they just sort of undertuned them a little bit. I am actually really rooting for this character to get some kind of unique equipment or a potentially a very very early zenkai we'll see but this character definitely needs some help and it's just really sad that uh a character that came out only five months ago was already this uh this down in the dumps legitimately tell me in the comments when was the last time you encountered this character in pvp i think for me it's probably been three months since i've seen this character one time in pvp so we're going to go ahead and try and make the best use of them as possible. We are going to be running a Sun Family team with Goku and Frieza and Revival UI Goku, just so that we can give as many Zenkai buffs to them as possible. We're giving two Zenkai buffs here. I think this is a pretty good setup. We have a uh, pretty Blast-centric team here, even though Goku and Frieza can sort of be ran either way, Blast or, or Strike-based. Um, Equipment-wise, we're going with this. This is like a ridiculous equip for them. A bunch of Blast HP in the Strike Defense. We have this over here, which is going to give them Pure Blast. We need a God Key battle member, which of course we do. Some extra defenses and then base blast and then finally we're going to be running this as well uh, because we are running goku and frieza to get the full pure boosts as well as some hp so let's jump in um and we will see how much spotlight we can give to the uh, super saiyan 3 goku super saiyan 2 uh, vegeta tag boo saga character the final showdown versus kid boo such a cool character it's just so unfortunate how uh, they were treated honestly All right, let's see what we got here. We have Ginyu on Fusion Warriors. Interesting. Um, I, actually, again, Ginyu is a character where I, I actually think you can probably just throw him on almost any team. Okay, we can get covered all with these guys here. Let's go. I would like if we didn't have a full strike hand. Okay, thanks for the million strike cards. Well, we tried our best. Uh, wait, what? I, I obviously meant to click the blast. I did not. <laughs> I didn't mean to go for a full screen blue like that. That's not at all what I wanted to do. Okay, I'm, I'm fine with waiting. The sand is terrible, man. What do I do here? I'm gonna press this. That's actually not horrible damage. Cool. He's got a switch. Yeah, there we go. I think I'm just going to rush. He's not had a lot of chances to rack up Ginyu's revive chance here, so I feel pretty good about this. We'll see. He's think, what, he's, out, he's dodged like one attack, so it's, he's probably got a, around a 50% chance to revive, maybe even a little less. Let's see if you get lucky. 
He revived. Great. Alright, we got a lucky. Alright, well, can't win every time. Goes for a blast right there, interesting. He has not used his Vegito Vanish Removal yet, right? And he's still saving it. Let's tap attack here. Interesting. I thought I'd change it time. Uh, well, we can't go to Vegeta. I guess we just go to Revive Goku. Rock is fine. I mean, I... I don't even want to... Activate the transcendent mode. Like, imagine locking in Vegito Blue, you just lose the game. <laughs> or not locking him in, but you're locked in with your Vegeta against Vegito Blue. Like, the game's over, right? Alright, we can go back to Goku now. We can start getting card draw speed going here. Alright, let's go. I, again, I don't. I, this is not bad damage. I, I don't want to get Vegito locked in like this. But, on the other hand, I really do want to try and get the LF. It's been, again, like three months since I've seen the LF on this unit. Let's just do it here, I think. Okay. I don't think you can go back into Vegito yet, so we should be able to kill the Ginyu here. Okay, I mean, are we just dead? He has his ult on Vegito, I think, still, right? No, he's gonna really get the dude, what? You literally just needed to start one combo and I think you could have won this. Like, you, you easily kill this Vegeta and then you just like snowball from here. I mean, it would be tough, but... Okay, I mean, we at least got to show them off a little bit in this first match, I'm pretty content with that. All right, we just got pure LOE, it looks like here. All right, let's see what we can do here. I'm surprised he's letting him take all this damage. All right, well, that was the end of that combo. I love how going into Vegeta is an instant combo breaker. You like you, you literally end your own, your own combo by going into Vegeta. <laughs> it makes no sense. Really? Okay. So he he cancelled his cover change by using a blue. I don't, I don't really understand. Okay. Just get this. Switch gauge, bolt up as much as we can. Yeah, no card draw speed really. Dude, is that... Can you do actual damage, please? Jesus Christ. Uh, at least we killed him. I'm gonna go back into Goku and press the green. That was like pathetic blue card damage there. I don't know what that is. I'm gonna go right away with this. He doesn't die up right away? Okay. What are you doing? You have no vanish. He is type neutral though. And unfortunately we did use up the uh cover null from the Goku side. No blast. Okay, cool. Of course. Zero blast cards off that green. I'm gonna just grab the rush. I'm gonna jump again. Actually, I'm gonna I'm gonna tag. Another green. I'm gonna charge for a sec. What the? What are you doing? Is he dead? <laughs> okay. I think he pressed his rush and he had to cancel it. I, I'm just so confused. With what's going on? Okay. Well, 
I guess Goku, uh, Goku and Vegeta did kill Goku and Freeze. I'll take that. All right, we got this team here, huh? We go right away. Oh, he actually sidesteps there? Wow. Most of the time, people go right away when you vanish and attack at that timing. That was a late vanish. Oh, this is bad. Oh my god. <laughs> this character's so dumb. This Namek Goku. Like, like compare this Namek... Wait, what? Compare this Namek Goku to the boot. <laughs> it's like not even... Not even remotely comparable at all. It's kind of sad. Alright, well, unfortunately, we couldn't even string together a long enough combo to get our switch gauge even close to being filled up. Vito? No, Vito. Vito now? No. Okay. There he is. <laughs> okay, I mean, I had only strikes, so. Alright, so we made him waste his. Oh, God. I made him waste his Vanish Reduction, which is nice. Is that doing enough damage? Jesus Christ, this Goku hits like a monster truck. Okay, that's terrible. A green card. Let's go with this, I guess. I don't really... Wait, what? Okay, I don't want to switch to Vegeta here. I mean, do we lose? Like... <laughs> nah, we're good. We're not going to be able to get the Transcendent mode. I mean, it's just not going to happen. Alright, is, is he, is he going to live though? He actually lived. And he's going to main. It's good for us, I guess. We shouldn't be able to switch to Vegito yet. Okay, that was wrong. I, again, don't want to go to Vegeta. We get touched one time by this Vegito with a uh, Vegeta. Look how much Goku took from that. Yeah. He goes, what? I'm a rush! All right, well, we have to give up. Wait, what? Let's give it, you know? I'm, I'm so... He's living this, because he's going to be type neutral. Ah, uh, yeah, he's, he's alive. Anything? No? Blast armor, you're dead. Yeah, okay. Got the name of Goku. <laughs> That's a godly draw right there. We call that the Yugi draw. I mean, I think this is a pretty good match to represent why the boots you are just tough to use. Like, you never want to switch to Vegeta when the enemy has VB. You never want to go into the transcendent mode when they have VB. They're just, they're not resilient enough, I guess is the takeaway here. All right, this could actually potentially be a pretty interesting match. Um, uh, I guess Vegeta could potentially put in work against Rose. We'll, we'll see how this plays out. The guy, he stands there and does nothing. Pretty good. I mean, wish I had cards. <laughs> wish I had cards to actually chain into Vegeta. That's pretty good damage to Rose. I'll take that. He's a blue. All right, let's do this. I'm gonna actually drop here. He's gonna go into hit. Doesn't go into hit. Um, uh, I think I'm just gonna do it. His hand's terrible. I'll pop this too. Right, unfortunately, our Dragon Ball is on the blue card. Another green. I'm just gonna use it again. Keep drawing cards, extending the combo out here. Alright, let's grab our... Well, we didn't grab our rush, but a Dragon Ball. This is not going to kill. He's going to main, I guess? Yes, too. 
No? Hey, is this gonna launch the blue like a normal Rose player? No? Alright, you should be dead to that. Perfect. Let's back up. This is really scary, really scary, really scary. <sighs> okay, well, they're dead. <laughs> I don't think they're living this. He had a green and a blue, too. Yeah, he pretty much had a perfect hand for this. Uh, he's not he's not ulting? Uh, I think we're alive. I think. Why would you not... Oh my god, they died? Five million? It wasn't even close! Isn't this like... Is this like a six star hit or something? Are you serious? Oh my god, you get instantly incinerated. <laughs> Is it blue? I'm in a green. Oh, he misses that, okay. Alright, well, I don't know. Uh, that was pretty embarrassing by Vegeta there. Alright, VB on Universal Reps. Okay. He killed my green card, I just realized that. Uh, I'll see that. Um, how do I want to play this? I guess I'll just stay in for now, no reason for me to switch here. Okay, well that's... Uh, I'd rather not have this clogged hand of blue cards, I'm just gonna use one. I'm gonna immediately press this just so we can grab the Dragon Ball. Okay. I might have meant to click attack there and it just got screwed up. Happens to me a lot. Alright, well, I mean, this is just going to be a Goku and Freezing match, I guess. Okay. This might have been a mistake. Yeah, because we've <laughs> lowered card draw speed. Oh, God. Okay. Wolf we'll cover and all. Dude, can this Vegeta do anything? No blue. Okay. I mean, the, the problem really is just Vegeta, I think. Like, I... You obviously have to tag to build up the unique gauge to get to the preparation mode, but... I, I think the correct way to use the character is you just don't tag. I, I, I legitimately think that is the correct way to use this character right now, is you actually just don't tag at all. This guy's done the same thing like four times in a row now. I'm gonna go right away, I have nothing else to do. I actually legitimately think like you're just not supposed to tag with this unit. I don't... <laughs> okay. Well... Oh wait, no, we can switch here. No, we can't. <laughs> okay, well, Vegeta's dead. Yeah, I, I actually... Okay, so we're gonna do one more match after this. I think the way to use this character is you just never tag. I think. It's kind of like Vegeta and Trunks. You never want to go to the Vegeta side. Why is the Vegeta side of these tag characters always so... Like, they're always, they always suck. Makes no sense. Ah, right, he's dead. Because his character's dumb. I'll turn on to the next one.
らいなら私一人でも十分なんですがねそりゃオーラのつぶきだっていざ Alrighty, I think we'll probably make this the final match here. I mean, I guess we'll try and just never tag. <laughs> Sounds to me like that's actually the correct way to use this character, which is pretty sad. Okay, well, that sucks. Um, the problem with doing that is... Okay. The problem with doing that is um, Goku doesn't get cover and all, right, if you never, if you never, you never tag into him. Because he gets covering all his first time entering the battlefield when he uses a card, and then he gets covering all again whenever he tags in from Vegeta. So, are she gonna? Okay, we we risked it and it paid off there. I guess I could go to Vegeta here, man, but I just I don't want to be stuck in with him. That's the problem. It never seems worth it to go into him. Like I'd rather just never tag. It's just sad, really. It, it really is sad. Trunks. Wow. Okay, he was really ready for that. Uh, do Goku and Vegeta get one-shotted by this blue? <laughs> what do you guys think? We should test this, huh? 2.8 million? No, they're alive, but it's, it's definitely a lot of damage. All right, well. Uh... I wouldn't really particularly say that's good. I'm gonna save that blue card for Goku and Freezer. Uh. I should have just rushed there. Oh god. Oh god. No! <laughs> Don't do it! Okay. Alright, I'm staying true to the strategy, which is just to never tag. I mean, at this point, our HP is so low, it doesn't really matter if we tag, because we get one shot by any attack anyway. I guess now we can do it. <sighs> I, I don't know, man. This, this, this character needs a lot. And it, it honestly, I'm, I'm going to let Revival Goku go here. I, okay, I didn't really want to draw that green, but whatever. We're at the point now where I don't... Will a, a unique equipment be enough? Like, it's actually kind of sad that we're at the point where I don't even... Is the unique equipment going to be enough for them here? I don't know. All right, here we can actually do some stuff, I think. Okay, that's not bad damage. If we keep drawing blasts, we should be okay. He's gonna get. He's gonna let this thing go off here, right? Yeah, the gauge. Nice wait there. Okay. Yeah, I don't. Uh, I don't feel. I don't feel too confident about this character in any situation. Right away. Okay. Well, there you go. There's the showcase. They suck. <laughs> I don't think anybody's surprised that they suck. Is anybody surprised they suck? I'm not. Okay. Well. Does, he, does he just ult? Go for it. It has vanished still? What, since when? Um, I'm gonna let them stay. I'm gonna let the UI stay alive here. Okay. <laughs> of course. Of course, man. Of course. Wait, what? <laughs> I don't understand. Alright, let's go back to the UI. We'll have UI and Goku and Frieza clean this matchup, but let me know down below what you guys think of the incredible Boo. Saga duo, Super Saiyan 3 Goku and Super Saiyan 2 Vegeta. I just, 
I actually legitimately think it's so sad. Like, how could they how could they miss the mark so much? It it actually doesn't really make sense to me. Not really too sure how they did that. It's actually impressive how how like underperforming this character is. It's so bad to the point that it's actually I don't even know how they did it. I don't know how they did it. I, I don't. I don't know how they did it. <laughs> I don't want to say it was intentional, because I don't think it was intentional, but it definitely seems a little suspect. Okay. I, I'm going to prioritize UI in this situation. It keeps tapping, so... Okay, that's not what I wanted to do at all. Awesome, dude. Nice hand. I think this hand's good. Okay, well, <laughs> there we go. I'm out. Goku and Vegeta suck. Let's go. Let's move on to the next video.